Hello viewers and welcome to a new episode of Lancer 101. Since Long Rim Supplement is finally out, and it comes with two new talents to use, I might as well talk about them as soon as possible. So, number 30th talent, Black Thumb. Black Thumb is a talent for those that want to get out and fix problems, specifically, problems plaguing your mech, whether that's enemies or actual technical problems, mostly the latter though, I have already mentioned how lethal mech combat is for a squishy human being. Rank 1, Flesh to Metal. Not only you get to dismount with quick action now, you also get a personal shield that reduce any incoming damage to zero. However, it only works once, and only refreshes when you dismount again. You also only have one of it, and it lasts until the end of the scene. Rank 2, Rodeo. As a protocol, you can ride your mech like a cowboy with Black Thumb Rodeo protocol while also gaining a personal shield. You are immune to involuntary movement, occupy your mech's space, and move with your mech when in rodeo. This does not count as dismount and unless you have an NHP to drive your mech, it's not going anywhere. While in rodeo, your pilot can get shot, and as soon as your shield is down, you immediately go back in, ending the effect, and cannot start rodeo again on your next turn. You can also end rodeo with a quick action. While in rodeo, your pilot can only do the following full actions, all of which let you patch up or remove statuses from your mech. Obviously, self-inflicted conditions cannot be cleared. Rank 3, Rodeo Master. Let's you perform all those actions on nearby allies. In a nutshell, take this talent if you are okay with someone else driving your mech around while you constantly patch it up just to make sure it doesn't die in the process. Next, number 31st talent, Spaceborn. Spaceborn, despite its name, is a talent good for both ground and space. Honestly the better name would be Mech Tai Chi because this talent will be turning any incoming energy back around, ensuring that you will always be moving, and your enemies will not. Rank 1, Home in the Void. Your mech now has integrated EVA module, so you can fly and swim in 0G and underwater with no problem. And with a quick action, you can overcharge your EVA module to fly for 3 spaces and take heat equal to your size plus 1, though you must land at the end of the movement or fall. Rank 2, Sea Legs. For once per round, when your mech is being involuntarily moved by attack or failed save, you can choose the direction you get moved. Additionally, when your mech gets up from being prone, you get to move two spaces in any direction as a free action that ignores engagement and doesn't provoke reaction. Rank 3, Scrapper. For once per round, when you hit a character with melee attack, you can immediately give that character plus one difficulty on all checks or saves to avoid knockback, prone, slowed, and immobilized, until the end of its next turn. This also includes effects from said triggering attack. In total, this talent is amazing in preventing you from ever being out of position while making it easier for you to do the opposite to whoever that's in your way. Well, that's all talents you could get from the long rim supplement. And with that done, I will see you all next time.